All right, Scott, I'll go ahead and have a seat here on the couch. Perfect. All right, very cute. That couch is a little bit big for you, huh? Yeah, you dangle off. <laughs> <laughs> You're fine. Just get me comfortable. It's fine. Uh, okay, I got you centered here. Okay, so like I told you before, lights are on, the cameras are rolling. Okay. Um, and what we're going to do here today is... Do you want me to look at that camera or yeah. Look at me. We're just, okay. just us talking. These, they're just I here. I like... <laughs> no, no, the, the, the camera is here so we can, you know, just uh, get you used to being in front of the camera and the lights. You know, that's all the whole thing is. So, um, what we're going to do here is, is interview you, you know, give a little demonstration about what you can do and uh, some, you know, stuff like that. And then I'm going to edit it down and send it to the producers and the directors I work with. Woohoo! Okay, and then based upon that, we'll, uh, we'll get you booked. Any questions? No. Nope. No? Okay. Uh, before we get started, do you have your ID on you? I do. All right, let me just take a quick look at that. All right, you can actually stay standing up here for oh. this next part. What I want you to do is introduce yourself to these guys. Okay, they've, they've never seen you before, never met you before, so I want to make a good introduction. So my camera over here to the right, take a look over there. Hello. All right, and just tell them your name, your age, where you're from, and let them know you're excited to get started in the business. All right, my name is Skylar Green. I just turned 21. I'm from Arizona. Woo! And I'm excited to suck some dick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead and have a seat. Like the energy. Very, yeah. very good. Uh, I have a lot of energy. That's so. good. That's good. So, Arizona, huh? Yeah, it's really hot there. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's been some, a few girls coming out of Arizona. I don't know what it is. Actually, I don't know. Probably like five or six. Really? Okay. And do they like kind of help you spur your decision to get into this? Yeah, we all kind of like motivate each other to just do bad things. And <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at least we're making money though, paying our bills. So that's good. Being Having fun. Responsible adults. Woo! <laughs> so, right? you, so you know like these girls are your friends or are you just kind of like... Um, I know some of them are like my really good friends. Mm -hmm. One of them actually we live together. Really? Yeah. Who, who do you live with? Well, I don't live with her anymore, but we used to live together for a little bit. She's oh. writer. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. And I have, yeah. I know yeah. very well. Okay. She's pretty crazy, too. She's, yeah, she's a fun girl. She's a firecracker. <laughs> very fun. So, you guys don't live together anymore? Oh, no. No. I uh, just terminated my lease, actually. So, I'm going to be moving soon, and I don't really know where I'm going. Okay. <laughs> but got to get some money and got to... Well, I just don't even know what state I want to live in anymore, you know? Oh, well, so you're just out there. Okay. Yeah. Who, who are the contenders? I mean, I'm either thinking about California mm -hmm. or, I guess, another apartment in Arizona. But I'm just kind of bored of it, you know? Mm -hmm. Have you, like, were you born and raised in Arizona? No, no. I was born in Oklahoma, actually. Okay. Really? Yep. How long okay, did you live there? Okay, see? Okay, <laughs> see? How long did you live there for? <laughs> Not long enough, I guess, for me to really remember. But I've actually lived in eight or nine states. Wow. What are you, like a military brat or? I wish. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, no, I don't know. My family just moved around a lot okay. based on my dad's job. But he wasn't in the military or anything. Okay. He was just like for business brought us. Okay. Wherever the wind blew me, I went. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, was that weird for you growing up? Like, you didn't get to like really, you know, put put any roots down and, and make like long term. I don't know if you keep in contact with any of the friends. Um, there, but. Honestly, no, because I feel like most of my childhood friends, it's like we've grown apart so much. You know, it's like I went this way, they went that way, mm -hmm. and it's like now our past will like never like. You know what I'm saying? Just, yeah. Even if like I would have lived next to them my whole life, it's just. Woo, we are way too different now. I like penis and pussy, and you like to go to school and <laughs> work eight to five. <laughs> you know, it's just like, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. What are you doing right now, like, for work? Um, I'm just trying to get into, like, modeling. Um, okay. Just do what I can, I guess. So, I mean, you got a great, a great look. Very, Thanks. you know, petite, but great, great look. Now, one thing I'm kind of curious, growing up... And, and moving around like that, did you find it hard to like meet people 
and make friends generally or no i felt like i actually learned how to make friends faster and like more efficiently i guess just because i could i know i'm only going to be here for probably a year so who's going to be my friend you <laughs> you look like a good person yeah. you know and the reason i asked it is because like right here you just came right on and we're just having conversations you're not yeah. nervous or like in a little show you're just like I, there you go yeah i feel like i can honestly talk to anyone um I don't know if you can speak. Then I feel like there's going to be something, something I can like, you know, grab out of you that uh, I can relate to, or I can conversate about, or you know what I'm saying? It's yeah. just tell a joke or whatever. It's just let's keep this conversation rolling and be natural. Because I hate when you're talking to someone and it's almost like you don't even feel like they're paying attention or listening, or mm -hmm. they just don't understand, and you feel like you're just talking to a rock. Yeah. Like, I've had better conversations with myself. <laughs> like, please. <laughs> so like, high school, was that, did you bounce around different high schools, or did you kind of have, um, like... I actually went to only two high schools. I went to a boarding school my freshman year. Mm -hmm. And then my last two years, I just went to public school. And then I graduated early because I hated high school. <laughs> You went to boarding school? Mm-hmm. Now, I've, I've, I don't know exactly what boarding school is, honestly. I would say there's like a couple different kinds of boarding school. I didn't go to like the, you have like study hall every day for like this many hours and you know, drug tests. And it wasn't like discipline, you know, it was yeah. college prep school. But yeah, I honestly loved it. I met some really good people there. Mm -hmm. I learned like really good life skills. Mm-hmm. But... Now is it like a dorm kind of yeah. thing? Yeah. So you didn't really go home? Well no, you like live on campus. And then they have, well, I mean it's high school so it's not necessarily college, but similar. Mm -hmm. So it's like guys live on this side of the campus, girls live over here. And then our teachers actually lived on campus as well. Okay, wow. So they just have houses like all around. It was, um, it's in Arizona, but I don't know, it's just like horse land almost. Uh -huh. So you couldn't really like get out of there and go, go crazy? Well, you're not allowed to have a car there. And I was like freshman, you know, I couldn't drive anyways. Yeah. Okay. But every weekend they would have, um, I don't know, just like little fun weekly planned trips where you'd go to like Walmart. I mean, Walmart's not that great, but I mean, I like it, so. <laughs> so did you ever get to do anything that like, that you think is going to, Will they benefit you in this business? When you say you're trying to get into modeling now, have you have you done any modeling? Um, just you know, with my ex boyfriend and our handy dandy camera. Oh, okay. So you actually like filmed yourself having sex before? Yes, but okay. I mean, well, somewhat. <laughs> I don't know. I go ahead and explain that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, just more of like you know, solos, or I guess like trying to do like a striptease, but like failing, and I don't know. <laughs> trying to be sexy, but like not figuring it out, cause I have just like a little phone. <laughs> okay. But I don't know, I thought it'd be kind of fun. So you were, but you were that girlfriend though? That was like, I'll do, make a little video for him and hopefully he'll like it? Yeah, I tried. What, what was, okay, give me, <laughs> this is actually pretty interesting. Give me, give me an example, what did you try to do? Oh my gosh. Uh, let's see, I don't know, it was always hard because it's like I'm trying to hold it while like, you know, trying to show off the goodies and mm -hmm. it just wasn't a good picture, <laughs> I guess, <laughs> I don't know, I instantly deleted them all and I was like, never again, <laughs> then I was like, well, I don't know, maybe, like when we broke up, I was like, hmm. Did you save them all? No, I actually did it, but I don't know. It's probably a good thing. <laughs> so you looked at all of you like this. Like, this sucks. Well, yeah, because it's like I don't know. I didn't really know how to position myself to like oh. look good. Didn't know anything about lighting. It's yeah. like I'm in the dark. Like whatever. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But I don't know. It was interesting, but no, they were terrible films. They were <laughs> terrible pictures. I'd always do like a selfie in like the mirror and I'm like, oh, I look so like MySpace. <laughs> like, hey, look, you're naked. I look terrible. Yeah.